Hello, Tim Nelson. Back out here again, try to get another shot of this picture back here. That's what I blew out the sky on last time I was here. Snow's a little soft. I'm sinking in in spots. Should have brought my snowshoes. But uh, it didn't. So it's a little bit of a tough walk back here. I'll uh, swing this camera around just a little bit and give you an idea of what I've been doing. That's kind of what it looks like back here. Brought my better tripod this time. That's the way I came in, Sonia. Got my dog with me, of course. She's lots of fun, but that's the way I came walking in on. So anyway, not too bad a walk. It's I don't know about probably three quarters of a mile back here. But anyway. I'm going to try to take a few more shots of those mountains back there. I just wish the little treetops weren't in the way, but it's kind of hard to find a spot on this road where it's open good enough to, you know, get some good pictures without treetops in the way. So, but I'll do what I can here. I've got uh, my adjustments right on my camera this time, so I'm not going to, you know, have a problem seeing what I'm taking a picture of. I don't really use a live shoot, but uh, I might try doing that today just so I can, you know, see what I'm getting without having to take a half a dozen pictures and make adjustments. So, anyway, I'm going to do that now. I'm going to put this camera away and get my other one out. I'm shooting my videos on a Canon 80D, and I'm taking my pictures with a Canon uh, Mark V, or Mark IV, excuse me. So... Anyways, dog's wanting to go, but uh, anyways, I'll uh, see what I can do here. There's another spot uh, back up by the parking lot. I might try to hike up that hill if the snow's not too soft and uh, see what I can see from up there. Maybe I can get some better shots uh, towards the west if the sun don't swing around too much and get my face by then. But for now, though, I'm going to take a few shots here. And walk up that road a little farther and uh, see if there's anything better uh, view of those mountains back here. So, anyways, we'll see what turns out. Well, I'm back. This is uh, about far up the hill as I'm going to go. I'm starting to hit a point where I'm sinking about knee deep about every five or six steps and uh, it's just getting too much. My pack's probably about 40 pounds or so with camera gear and I made it quite a big ways up but uh, I'm just not going to go any farther. It looks every time I think I'm getting close to the top it's another uphill stretch. So I'll see if I can't get behind this uh, camera and swing it around just a little bit. Hopefully my dog will stay put. I've got her tied to the pack right now. Should be good enough anchor. Sound like some coyotes may have been up in the distance uh, yapping a bit. Got my dog spooked. She was pulling me up the hill. Now the last 20 yards or so I've been pulling her up the hill. But anyways, I'll uh, kind of swing this around a little bit and uh, give you a view here of where I'm at. Like I said, I wish I could come up a little farther, but maybe another week or two when some of this melts off. So here goes. I can get back here. Man. That's no fun when you sink to the top of your boots all the time. Here's saying Sonia. Anyway, hope you're hearing me all right. I forgot to put my mic on the camera. I get forgetful in my old age, so there she is. She's looking around. She's a little nervous. She's not sure, you know, hasn't been out in the woods with me too much, so. Plus, she's kind of scared of her own shadow. When I got her out of the pound, they told me she'd been kept in a crate all day long for up to 10 hours at a time, and every little bumper noise just gets her spooked. She about turns inside out, so. I'll level this back out a bit and give you a shot of the view here. I 
let's say you know this up in the woods trees are getting in the way of everything but that's the trail I came up on and I just sunk down on my knee again that's where I still need to go to get to the top but I'm just not going to do that oh now the tripod's wanting to sink again see if I can't get back leveled out again Anyway, it is nice up here. It's just an awful tough walk to get here. So, yeah, we're all crooked, aren't we? Well, anyways, that'll have to do for now. You see, I just keep every other step is, you know, about knee deep. So I'm going to head back down to the parking lot, but kind of worth the climb. I just wish some of these trees weren't in the way so I could get a better picture, but who knows, maybe at the top I could. But that's just gonna have to wait for another time. There was only one car here, and he was uh, kinda behind a snow berm from the snow plows, so I don't know if he's setting up camp for the night or not. He's got one of those uh, tents that uh, sit on top of the vehicle. It was in the uh, low 50s when I met, left the house, but sun on you makes it feel like it's in the 80s. So anyways, I'll shut this off and Get back down the hill.